Welcome to Pickleball by Pros, the world leader in digital pickleball instruction. Welcome back to pickleballbypros.com. This is Frank Anthony Davis, and today I want to talk to you about a really fun shot that a lot of people really like, but very few people know how to implement properly. So we're talking about the Ernie. That's the shot when you actually step or jump outside of the court as you're dinking, and what you're allowed to do outside of the court is you're allowed to hit a volley as long as your feet don't step in the kitchen or anywhere on the court. So the other thing to keep in mind is you have to hit the ball on your side of the net. So you wanna be really solid with your movement and you wanna wait, you wanna be very patient and wait for the right opportunity. So what I'm gonna do here, I'm gonna push in a regular dinking rally, I'm gonna push Rafa to the middle and then he's likely, because I push in the middle, he's gonna give me a neutral ball back to my body and what that gives me the option to do if it bounces high enough is I can push it to his backhand down the line. And I want to wait just for the right moment for when he looks down at the ball or he is making contact with the ball. That gives me the split second to start moving into Ernie position. And you want to do that, make that decision and stay consistent with it. And as soon as he dinks it up, then all you have to do is walk over there and just hit it straight down at their feet. And the likelihood of them getting that back is very low. So watch as me and Rafa play out this scenario, and I hit an Ernie. All right, so there it is. That's an Ernie. It's one of the most fun shots in the sport if you can master it, but it's really, really difficult. So I say start trying it, start testing it, and over time you'll get a better feel for how, how it works. And when you hit your first one, definitely send us a message and let us know because that's going to be really exciting. Thanks for joining us at pickleballbypros.com where you can learn from the world's best. Thanks for watching our video on how to hit an Ernie. Let's review our primary focus points. So when we're trying to hit an Ernie, we really want to focus on patience primarily because I see a lot of people who get excited about an Ernie and they're a little bit over eager. So they're always moving into position. They're always trying to look for it. It's really not a shot that comes up that often, but it's really effective if you use it at the right moment. So be patient. Don't be over eager. Number two, we really want to focus on moving our opponent around, even if it's just a small distance. So we can move them to the center of the court and then back to the sideline. And when we successfully get them to move back to the sideline with our dink, that's when we make our movement, our motion to, to hit the ball as an Ernie, right? So we want to wait until they look down. And when they look down at the ball, their eyes go from us to the ball. That's when we kind of make our move. The final thing that we want to remember is when we actually move over there, we don't want to rush to move over there because remember, they're not looking at us. So we already have that time to move. So make sure that you move through the kitchen, but get your feet planted outside of the kitchen, outside of the court, and then hit the ball. You can't actually hit the ball with your foot in the kitchen or with your foot exiting the kitchen. You have to have both feet planted on the ground outside of the kitchen before you make contact. So be patient, don't be over eager, and thanks for watching us at Pickleball by Pros. I'm Frank Anthony Davis, and I hope to see you on the court soon. Pickleball by Pros, where you learn from the world's best.